and welcome back to one of my another one of my videos or back to my channel um today's video is going to be um a bit more on the serious side i know i don't often do serious videos but today um is going to be a little bit more serious um it is going to be mainly for people over 25 um because this is what it applies to even though I do think the age range should be lower to lower to 18 you probably guess but I am going for a smear test today um, we all know it's it's not very you know it's not very, quite embarrassing and we do put it off which is the same as I have but we know we need to go and do it it is important it can save lives so this is what I'm going to tell you about today I want to give you a few tips. Um, I've had a few done before. Um, yes, okay, it can be very embarrassing and a bit uncomfortable, but we all need to um, go and have them done, okay? They do save lives. The first tip would be, obviously, to go and get it done. No, <laughs> the first tip is mainly not to have a bath. Make sure you wash down below. Obviously, we don't want no smelly bits, but... Um, do not use talcum powder or body spray or anything on those parts, okay? They do tend to dry your lady parts out, which makes it harder for the nurse to take a test. She does like it to be a little bit more lubricant -y down there. Um, obviously, it makes it easier for her to take the test, okay? So, have a wash. Do not use any talc spray or anything like that. Right, second um, piece of advice I would I could give you would be to either wear a skirt or to wear a long top. Okay, this obviously hides a bit of you, gives you a bit more privacy. Um, with a skirt, all you got to do is obviously take off your knickers. You can leave your skirt on. A long top again, obviously it does cover up your lady bits a bit. The nurse usually does give you a towel, a paper towel to put over your lady part, so you hide your give you a bit of dignity okay um they usually are very lovely ladies so do not worry about that either okay third advice would be no it's easier said than done we all get a bit uptight and it is it is quite a sort of embarrassing nervous thing to have done but is try to be relaxed and calm as much as you can because obviously the more uptight you get the more stress you get the tighter your muscles will get okay and obviously the tighter your muscles get, the harder it will be for the nurse to take her test. So take some deep breaths, breaths before she takes the test, okay? If it helps for you to talk to her, makes you more relaxed, then do so. They're usually very nice ladies. When I'm not being funny, they've seen lots and lots of ladies' parts before. Yours is no different from anybody else's. It's just a job to them, okay? So... Um, if it does help to talk to her and makes you more relaxed, then do so. Fourth thing I would or you do need to take with you is um, some sanity to take a sanity towel with you because after you have had your test, you can bleed. It is very likely you might bleed afterwards. Okay, so come prepared with a towel. Not always. You don't always bleed, but most of the time you will bleed for a little while. Okay. Right, I better go now um, and get ready to go and have my smear test. I'm um, going to go and tidy up my lady bush because um, at the moment it's a bit of a jungle down there. I would recommend that you um, have a bit of a trim maybe down there. We do not want the nurse getting lost in the bush. She might never ever come out again. All right, must go and do that. Also, um, I think I better shave my legs so otherwise she might think I'm, I'm a bit of an ape. So that's another thing I've got to go and do. So... Um, we'll be doing this <laughs> right back on a serious note before I go please please ladies go and have your smear tests um, they do save lives we do what you all around a bit longer yes you might have to wait about two weeks for your test results to come back okay but please please go and have smear tests um, don't keep putting it off all right anyway um, I've forgotten what else I was going to say and before you go, do tidy up your jungles, okay? <laughs> uh, anyway, I'm going to say goodbye now. I'm going to thank you all for watching. Hopefully you'll come back and watch some more videos.
remember what I said though, get down to that nurse and have your smear tests, okay? Thank you all for watching. Bye bye for now. Bye 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 bye. Bye 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 bye.